begin the setup of your router to connect it to your Wi-Fi network, simply open the box Once we have opened the box, you'll find inside that there's an ethernet cord and a power cord, along with the router. To begin the installation and setup process, pull both antennas up and slide the power cord inside the power slot. From there, we will plug it into the wall and connect it to our computer. Once you have completely assembled your router, simply place the AC power plug into the wall plug. From there, we will go to your Wi-Fi. You will see the Total Link A3 connect to this router. Once you have connected, we'll go to Internet Explorer. From there, we will type in the IP address of your router. This will always be 192.168.0.1. Once you've entered this, press enter on your computer. This will pull you up to the login for your Total Link router. The ID and the password will always be admin, and then type in the security letters at the bottom. It will ask you to do this twice just for added security. Once you are logged in, go to the Setup tool, select Advanced Setup, go to Wireless, and then Wireless Multi-Bridge. From there, we will change the 5 GHz to 2.4, go to the Mode, go to the drop-down tab, and we will select Wireless Wide Area Network, or WAN. Once we have done this, we will click AP Scan below Apply. This will pull up all available Wi-Fi routers in the area. Select the one that you would like to connect to and type in the password. Once you have done this, click Apply and hit OK. Give it about five seconds and then hit refresh. Once you've done this, it will say disconnected, but if you give it a few seconds, it will say connected eventually. Once it says connected, you are fully set up your router and you're ready to connect it to your SWNS software.